Hi there guys and welcome back to another FPV Guide video. This week I'm at the Interdrone Show 2016 in Las Vegas and I'm here with Valley Sang and we are looking at his brand new product from Power Vision. I was gonna turn the thing over so you can read it, but here it is, and this was the Power Eye. Yes. The Power Eye, I actually came to look at the Power Egg. And then yeah. I saw this thing and I was like, no, 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 we gotta look at this first. So there's a second video coming up with the Power Egg. Yes. But this here is really unique. It's basically what we normally would expect from an Inspire Pro in terms of features, except it's also got obstacle avoidance and it's got an FPV camera. Let me show you right here. Here's our obstacle avoidance up here and down here, Valley has put a FPV camera or rather a pilot camera the way I see it. But it gets better. No, really, it gets better. If I lift it up a little higher, down here you see a micro four thirds camera with a micro four thirds lens and it's got interchangeable lenses and to make our life easier, that is us as operators, Valley put a movable weight on the back end of this so you simply can dial in the balance before you start flying instead of having to use, like I usually do, taping some coins on the back of the camera. So this has microphone, microphone micro for, for sure. camera. Yeah. And you have one other camera for it also. Yes, we have a thermal camera on top of it, which is uh, you can choose for portfolio. So when you are flying with the EO thermal together, then you can switch on the on your on your station with one button. Switch to IR camera, EO uh, thermal camera. So for so for first and rescue. For the people of you guys out there right now that is inspecting solar plants, you're looking for the bad panels, you guys need thermal cameras. And this one is now available with a thermal option. So you can go out and you can look, you can use visible light camera and then one button switch to go to your thermal camera. Now, if we go around, things that's important to notice here is all of this folds down. So the arms unscrew right up here and they fold down. And other really cool feature, we've got the folding props, but we like that on most. Back here is the battery door. When I pop this open, battery. pull it open, and you're saying you're using two battery modules. Yes. Now you do need both batteries to do this. However, the advantage here is if one of the batteries are going south on you a little bit quickly, you're gonna get a battery warning, but you're not gonna see your complete cell going south. So you do have the advantage that we used to have in the old days when we liked to fly two or three batteries on a multi-roll. Yeah, that means, uh, and also for this one, this is detachable. Oh, you yeah. just broke the leg. <laughs> then you can put it uh, back and hold it. So yeah. we can remove the legs for transport. We have the camera here. And one of the really nice things with this camera, it's quite heavy. Yes. Meaning when you've got vibrations in flight, the camera has more energy to stabilize the video. Now, where do you guys come from? I have not seen Power Vision before. Okay, so to be frankly, we are already a global company. I'm gonna scoot you up to the camera okay. so we can hear you. So we, we are a global company right now. We, we've already have uh, INDs uh, in US, in Canada, in even Europe. And now we have a big team also in China. So we are a global IND and a sales uh, team of global aid. Wow, so we are a global company for, we, we call it Flying Robert. So that means we are not only offering Robert, uh, offering drones, but later we will have some new robot coming soon. So you do industrial robots? No, we are making the lifestyle robot for the future. Interesting. Yeah. I mean, I'm looking at this and how nice it's put together. Yeah. And it's definitely clear you know manufacturing. Sure, sure. sure. And you also apparently know electronics. Yeah, we are background, which is a commercial background. We are making helicopters, I mean, the many helicopters and and a lot of big drones. But now we are aiming to a consumer and prosumer market. Yeah, this is like basically a prosumer product. Sure, sure, sure. And if we were to put on the thermal camera, this would be a search and rescue, sure. industrial inspection. Like a forest fire control, a lot of applications. Uh, what kind of resolution will your thermal have? Uh, 640, uh, Excellent. Uh, 480. Yeah. I'm seeing a lot of 180 by 160, that's why I have to ask. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the best, I believe. Yeah. yeah. 
it, unless you have an HD. Sure, sure, sure. So, what, I have to ask you, what kind of price range are you aiming at here? Yeah, we are aiming the prof, prosumer market. Prosumer market. Yeah, so that means that will be not very expensive. That's uh, not an uh, industry level, but between the consumer and the industry. So that's the So target. between industry and consumer on this. Sure, sure. So but the performance have... already reached the industry level. Yeah, you, you say... I'm really looking forward to fly this. Okay, you will. Yeah, thank Excellent. you. Excellent. So guys, there you have it. We are looking at a prosumer product, but really the features they're putting into this has much more than we expected in prosumer just a year ago. And I like that this is essentially an Inspire Pro, but with obstacle avoidance and a built-in flight camera for the pilot. So that is two major features. We're gonna be test flying this eventually, so make sure you subscribe and stay tuned for more videos of this product and PowerVision drones in the future. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is really awesome. Thank you.